Hey guys, uh, this is C from C Visions Films. Uh, we're just gonna be doing a quick tutorial today about how to add video effects to your clips on your timeline in Sony Vegas Pro 10. Uh, we're not really gonna be going over, you know, what to do with, uh, with the different effects or things like that, but just how to access them and apply them to your clips. Um, so, for instance, we have two different clips on this track, on the same track right here. Um, if you were going to add an effect to this particular one, but not this one, there's some called the event FX. That's this icon right here underneath the crop icon. So if you go ahead and click the event uh, icon, what you want, you're going to have, you're going to pop up all the available uh, video effects that are on your computer. If you did add any additional plugins uh, that would also populate on this page so for instance if we're gonna apply some say maybe color correction that's the Sony color corrector if you're gonna apply that to your clip you can tap this right here click on the add button then you click on OK in doing that it pops up um, it pops up the window which you can you know expand and reduce as you like um, so basically it pops up the window that allows you to add the effects to your clip. Here's the preview window so if you start moving this in whatever direction you can see um, the color correction starts to happen on the right side of the screen. This is just based on how you have it set up so if you want to see if you want the effects to get applied to the side of the screen and not that one so you can monitor uh, keep in mind you want to have you want to have it this way, just so you can monitor what your original clip looks like. You know the tonal range, the colors, uh, the contrast, and things like that. Uh, just so you get a better you know feel of what you're adding to it. You can go to the split screen uh, icon right here. You can choose to select left half, which is what it's set on right now. You can choose to select the right half, which shows the other part. And if you do select all, it's just going to default to the original uh, content that you had. So we're just going to keep it this way for now. Um, this is just how to add an effect to one clip on the track. S uh, however, if you, if, if you want to add an effect and you want it to be applied to all the clips on that track, you need to go to this section right here, which is the main section and you see the same icon but in this case it's track effects so if you click on the track effect it goes over the same motions I'm just gonna close that out it goes over the exact same motions as before but this time around it's gonna add whatever effects you add to it it's gonna add it to every single clip that's on that track um, that's the difference between those so you only use event effects if you're dealing with one event you use the track effects if you're dealing with all the tracks on the uh, all the clips on the track um, up here right here you see a dialog uh, system options if you go ahead and click video effects that's another way to access the effect uh, options on in Sony Vegas there is a long list of options that you can access on here so for instance if you're gonna add say maybe uh, brightness and contrast for instance you can just click on that effect and you can drag it down to say if you're going to add it to this uh, particular clip you can drag it onto the clip and then you release it it does pop up the options up here and allows you to edit so if you turn the brightness but you want to make sure keep in mind you want to make sure for instance when I did that nothing happened that's because this particular clip which we're dealing with is not highlighted so if you click on this to highlight that one you can adjust that as you want you always want to be cognizant of that okay alright so those are the main ways to access uh, the video effect options in Sony Vegas Pro 10 um, this is pretty basic pretty simple um, and future tutorials we might go over you know how to effectively uh, apply this effects and things like that uh, for, but for now uh, we're just gonna leave it at you know being able to locate and proper properly uh, access these options 
Uh, if you have any further questions or anything, just leave a comment and we'll definitely uh, get back to you. Thank you.